Bros, in this video, I found a brand new client. Let's go and check it out in settings right now. But guys, while I'm doing this, make sure you are a subscriber on my YouTube channel and drop a big fat like on this video if you guys actually want to see more epic content. But without further ado, let's go get into it, guys. So right over here, we got the brand new Honey client. So without further ado, let's activate this thing, guys, and check it out. But there's a gear icon. Okay, so let's go press it and boom. Looks like there's a bunch of different resolutions. Oh, there's a bunch in here. Okay, so we got Ultra FPS, Edits Mode for Montages, Java rentering boys invisible players player esp x-ray goggles cracked inventory anti steve slash pink glitch that's actually really helpful wow hype about that we have useless x-ray um okay maybe it's like a fake hack texture pack or something i don't really know next up we actually have a murder mystery hack which i guess is actually a hack you guys can use on murder mystery once again would not recommend using hacking guys unless it is on like a private server but we actually do have that feature in over there and then over here we actually have high I did seek hack as well too once again guys only use it on your own server do not be hacking on like actual servers because you guys can get banned for it and then we also have one chunk render distance and then lastly squid game mode interesting all right guys so to start off i'm just gonna go with none and then we're gonna go ahead and actually activate a bunch of really cool stuff later in the video so definitely be sure to watch the whole entire thing guys but without further ado let's go and check out the brand new honey client see what the ui looks like and whoa okay this is actually pretty nice so as you guys can see we actually do have my whole entire character turn over here a brand new background brand new buttons and look at this boys it actually says my name right over there river one two three seven two five that is so sick so be sure to go and definitely take a look at we got my player with my brand new hive mc skin and then as you guys can see we got the buttons over here very cool whoa okay this actually looks really nice i like this i like this boys yeah be sure to go and definitely take a look at this big shout to creator once again as well be sure to go and subscribe to their youtube and everything and then we got the change skin button pretty cool boys but let's go ahead and head out of here and actually check out the uh, marketplace next let's see what this looks like is it custom and it looks like it is as well too as you guys can see we actually have it looks like the default backgrounds however the buttons over here are actually changed look at that boys that's actually kind of hype but anyway let's get out of there boys and let's go and take a look at uh, i guess client info so this over here it just says more features coming soon all right i'll take it boys i'll take it all right bros i'm about to go ahead next to create a world over here to go ahead and test this out all but listen to this button when i press it Yo, that's actually kind of cool. So be sure to go and definitely take a look at this if you guys would like to. It's a pretty cool client and it's got awesome button sounds. What can I say? Anyway, we're actually now back over here in game. And as you guys can see, we got some really cool features. The first thing I'm actually noticing over here, boys, is that we actually do have an armor HUD on the side. So basically, if I like go ahead and grab like some diamond armor over here, or whatever, it will actually go ahead and put it on, etc. We also have my paper doll now over there in the bottom right hand corner. And in the top corner, as you guys can see, we actually have the compass and we also have the clock which is pretty cool and also look at this when i'm hovering over a block it actually shows the whole entire thing which is actually kind of cool so be sure to go and definitely take a look at that for us but yeah this is actually overall pretty cool clients i hope you guys do like it look at this we also have a cape over here as well too guys and it's actually nemo big shout out to nemo great movie but yeah that is actually it over there guys be sure to go and definitely take a look at it anyway without further ado boys i'm actually now about to go ahead and save and quit and we're about to go check out basically the next one so yeah there's actually a lot of different versions and i'm gonna check them out on the video boys and yo looks like we also have a new menu as well too when we actually press the gear icon that is so cool so anyway we're gonna go ahead and go with ultra fps next boys and check this out and also it does say to restart your game okay so we're gonna go ahead and press back boys but in addition to that we're also gonna go and actually need to restart my game real quick and then open it up again to go ahead and get all the changes to be applied but anyway guys now we're actually gonna go and check out what ultra fps is actually in game so let's go ahead and do this thing right now guys and boom this is actually it. so yeah as you guys can see we've actually joined it yo it says uh honey clients enabled ultra fps this is actually kind of crazy so i'm actually not really too sure what the difference is to be honest i actually don't really see a difference boys maybe the render distance is actually like less i'm gonna go and have to look back later in the video because i i don't really know boys all right let me go and grab like some tnt or something we'll go ahead and grab like some tnt guys i'll grab some flint and steel we'll light that up we'll take a look at the health potions as well too and uh what else can i get and that's all i could think of boys let's just go ahead and test this out though so boom i'm gonna go and actually light a tnt boys see if they did go and reduce the fps for that and uh okay they did okay so there's actually no more explosions over there it just does it and then over here we actually do have uh literally nothing wow okay no particles at all guys be sure to go and definitely take a look at it over there and also look at that it's actually like 3d as well too that is actually very interesting boys but anyway without further ado let's go ahead and take a look at the next edit 
All right, guys, so the next version over here is actually the montage mode, and basically, it looks like it just goes ahead and gives you guys a green screen sky. So, yeah, if you guys want to go ahead and actually make, like, some really cool montages and, like, change the sky in Minecraft, well, now it's actually super easy because we have these whole entire green screen backgrounds over here, which is super cool, guys. But anyway, without further ado, let's take a look at the next edit. Alright guys, next up we're actually over here with the Java rendering, and I gotta be honest, I don't really know exactly what this means, but I guess it now renders like Java Edition, so yeah, if you guys do like Java Edition, well then definitely be sure to go and take a look at this, but without further ado guys, let's go and check out the next one. Alright boys, next up we've actually got the invisible players add-on, and look at this, this is so crazy, it literally makes everyone invisible, including yourself, so yeah, as you guys can see, I am actually completely invisible at the moment, and yeah, it's actually super cool, so be sure to go ahead and definitely take a look at it boys, like I'm literally invisible, it's insane, but without further ado guys, let's go ahead and take a look at the next edit. Next up, bros, we got player ESP. So take a look at this. As you guys can see, we actually now have a whole entire like outline around me. And basically, this will go ahead and work for other players as well, too. So if I did actually have someone else over here, we would actually be able to go ahead and see like this whole entire boxing around them. But anyway, guys, without further ado, let's take a look at the next one. Next up, we got Entity X-Array. So basically, what this does is it goes ahead and actually um gives us actually X-Array ourselves. So as you guys can see, we can like uh, see inside of my Minecraft too. But also, it basically works on like players as well too. And basically, entities like this skeleton over there, as you guys can see, is under the ground. And there's actually more skeletons as well too. Boom. As you can see, like right over there, boys. Like they're actually under the ground. Like that is so crazy. But we can actually go ahead and see them. So let me know what you guys do think about this. I think it's pretty cool but let's go ahead and take a look at the next one next up boys is a cracked inventory i actually do not have a mobile device but uh yeah be sure to go ahead and definitely take a look at that i don't really know what a cracked inventory means um if it just looks cracked or what but uh yeah i don't have mobile boys so i can't really show that one i'm sorry but then next up bros we actually do have this over here which is actually an anti steve slash pink glitch which is also one i'm just gonna go ahead and skip but yeah basically if you guys actually have ever had a glitch on like the hive or whatever where you're actually like you know getting all the players pink and like everything is just pink and it's glitched out well then be sure to go and definitely go with this over there boys and supposedly it will actually go and fix that which is actually pretty interesting anyway you can just go ahead and like restart your game to also go and fix it but i guess if you don't want like the chance of it actually happening if you just enable this pack i guess it will never actually even have the chance of happening so be sure to take a look at that bros but anyway next up we actually have useless x-ray i'm gonna take a look at this one boys i'm excited for it as well too because i don't know like what is useless x-ray all right, bro, so I'm back, and uh, this does not seem useless to me. Like, this is actually X-Ray, so be sure to go ahead and definitely take a look at As you guys can see, we actually do have entities over here, AK mobs, and I guess players too, but also we will go ahead and get look at this ores, and basically, it does, like, literally every ore. So as you guys can see, there is a lot. But yeah, we actually have coal right over there, and if I mine down, we can actually go and literally find coal, which is actually super cool. So be sure, guys, to definitely go ahead and take a look at this. Overall, pretty cool, but let's take a look at the next one. Anyway, bros, I'm gonna go and actually skip these next two over here because I actually do not want to go and get banned on a server, and I don't really have my own server that I can actually go and, like, test this out on. So, yeah, once again, would not recommend unless you guys do go ahead and do this, like, on your own server with, like, your friends or whatever, but, yeah, do not, like, hack on an actual server with that because you will definitely go ahead and get pants. But anyway, guys, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at this one over here, which is actually a one chunk render distance next up. And basically, if you guys don't know how big a chunk is, it's, like, about a 16 block by 16 block area, boys, so basically when we do go ahead and actually get in here we're only gonna be able to go and actually see between 16 and 16 blocks so yeah let's check this thing out boys hopefully we can actually play it but uh, okay so as you guys can see we're actually in over here and this is it so i would actually say it's a bit less honestly than like 16 by 16 boys it's actually pretty small over here but let me know what you guys do think about it so yeah we're obviously not gonna be able to go ahead and see as much now but that's kind of like the point over here is for like a bit of a challenge or if you guys do just need more fps so so yeah, this will 100% go ahead and actually give you guys more FPS. Once again, like this will literally go ahead and like quadruple your FPS. Like seriously, it is crazy, boys, how much FPS you can get from this. However, obviously, you're not going to be able to see that much. That's like the only downside. But hey, it's kind of like a fun challenge if you guys want to go and take a look at it. Also, I just realized this well too. We are actually like kind of flying this whole time. Or at least that's how it looks. If you guys go and take a look at it, as you can see, like there's a bit of a gap over there. And yeah, I'm actually shifting. Like I cannot go lower than this, boys. Basically 
literally that is just that is it so yeah let me know what you guys actually do think about it, it looks like we're literally flying but anyway without further ado boys we got one more to go and check out the final one squid game mode all right, bro, so I'm back over here, and as you can see, it's actually changed my skin to a Squid Game character over here. I think this is actually, like, one of the guards. And, yeah, if we go ahead and press play, I guess that's what it is. I don't really know. Maybe there's some other stuff. But, yeah, as you guys can see, we're a literal Squid Game guard. So, it looks like that is actually the only change over here in this one. However, it's actually kind of cool if you guys want to go ahead and get this super cool Squid Game themed skin over here. But, anyway, guys, that's basically about to go and actually wrap up today's episode. I really hope you guys actually have enjoyed. If you have, obviously, be sure to go and definitely drop a like subscribe for more and without further ado use this responsibly but without further ado i'll catch you guys in my next one peace out everybody